Like that, I don't... Oh my god, come on, man. Well, if we were a little better, we wouldn't, wouldn't be in that position. What the f what was that? Oh, wait, wait a minute. How did I just do that? If you hold select and hit the hit the the side like the left or right, you do a barrel roll. What? That's how you avoid those bullets. Okay, we got it. I think okay, actually you know what? I don't Yeah, cuz that's the same perspective. Yeah. So whenever those bullets come, you just roll to the other side. Got it. Oh, we are the best. Yeah. Yeah, because look, you go like all the way across the screen. So once those bullets get shot, you just roll to the other side. You, 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 I would think... Okay, so that might be something we can use. Of course you do. <laughs> Double tap on double tap on the right trigger for an any on an NES controller. I got it. <laughs> well, that's okay. I mean, we discovered something that might actually allow us to we I think we actually got pretty close to beating to finishing that thing off too I think because we have the whole bottom we, we just had like a couple targets on the top that were left It's also weird too because the way that he, the way that this thing flies, it like, it, it'll, it raises itself in increments. Like you can't just stop it whenever. So if it's, if it's being raised, there's no way to stop it. Although I think I just figured something out. Because I think. On the final boss, I think if I point my plane up, it'll just go up indefinitely. I think it's the same idea as those landing things. Actually, that's not a barrel roll, is it? Wait, does the selection work here? It does! I mean, I, I don't really see the use for it in this level, just because I'm pretty good at avoiding most of the stuff. We died a few times last run, but most of the time we're pretty good on this stage. I thought it. No, I think it's a barrel roll in Star Fox, but like that's not a real barrel roll in like flying. Am I am I just making that up? I could have swore it was like different. 
the bar I, I thought the barrel the barrel roll was like a completely different maneuver. No, it, I mean, it, it, that thing, the thing I'm doing is the thing that's in Star Fox, but I think in real life, I don't think that's what a barrel roll, a barrel roll is. I think it's something else. Oh, we avoided that, uh, that first missile. Is it? If you're wrong, you have to sub to the channel. That's how I get my sub. I have to, I, I have to bet them. That's how it works. Is this like a rumor? Maybe I'm wrong. That was the, the Atari graphics right there.
Well, they didn't, I don't think they didn't go out of business after the 7800 because the games were bad. I think because they oversaturated the market. Nobody was buying them. That's the, like, I think that, that's what the video game crash was all about, right? It was, it was like oversaturation. It wasn't the like graphics, like people, because no one knew better. Everyone knew arcades existed, but they just, everyone kind of accepted that the home console just wasn't going to be as good. I don't, it, like the, the, the graphics, I don't think caused the crash, or caused them to go out of business. I think they just oversaturated the market. And you know, in a weird way, you're, you're kind of seeing that with these these limited run, special release, special reserve like PlayStation games. Because at first, everyone was like, "Oh, you know, they're all, you know, they're going to be like rare and worth a lot of money later." No, no, they're not. Like, maybe the first few because the runs were so small. But now, like, there's you know, the, the runs are limited to like five thousand. Like that's still kind of a lot of a lot of copies of a game to be out there. Like most of the limited runs, unless you're getting those really expensive collector editions, which like I mean, you know, that's obviously a certain type of collector that is gonna go. I mean, I, I go for them when I can if it's a game I'm interested in. But there's some, some people just really like having those, and I just think now it's just I don't think things are gonna pan out for the for those people that are gonna try to hold on to like some weird PlayStation disc for like 30 years. I just I don't see that actually being a thing. This isn't even the hard hard level either, man. This sucks. That was a bad death. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, buddy. at the end. We can somehow get some extra lives, but I don't know how to do that. Probably something with killing a certain like number of enemies or something. Yeah, that would be because I'm you know I'm pretty much avoiding everything, so that would be a good incentive to actually actively go after the enemies because if you get an extra life. Our warrior. You want to see the barrel roll? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How cool would Top Gun have been if they actually had a barrel roll in that game? Like, where your whole screen just flips around for a second? <laughs> That'd be so cool. Alright, die. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, second mission has a, 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 a spin? That's pretty cool. I think I, I tried playing second mission, or yeah, Top Gun second mission. It's hard, man. It's way more difficult than the first game. Oh, this is the, 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 the package one. Okay. So we just gotta survive and drop off the packages. Yeah, uh, second mission, well, th the main reason why I find it difficult is because the space at which you're allowed to to use is smaller. Like the, like visually, the bullets hit you, they hit you when they're bigger, if that makes sense, like compared to the first game. So if you're used to the pacing and the spacing of the first game, you're going to die a lot in the second game, be j just because you don't know how close the, um, the bullets are to you. Because if you're used to the to, to top the first Top Gun, it like they have to be like really close to actually hit you, like the missiles and stuff. But in in second mission, like I you, know, you just if you're used to that certain visual cue, you're not gonna you're gonna you're not gonna do very well because the you're uh, you're you're you're, for, you're more forward in the screen than it looks compared to the first game. I, I never I don't even think I got past the second level in that game in second mission. And we'll have to do it eventually, but... So the plan is, once we get to the end again, the plan is we're gonna do the barrel roll thing. When, like, we're gonna go to a side, and then once... Oh, and you can shoot while you're doing that, too. Okay, so uh, once it shoots, we're gonna just roll to the side and just mash on the shooting on the, the gun button. Hopefully, we take stuff out while um, while being safe. Anyway, what's up, Nerd Warrior? Welcome back, man. missiles on accident. Yeah, I use those guys. That's how I got through Doom as a as a little as a kid. I just I just I save state every time I would like get into like a new room I would just save state. Okay, that, that, was, that was the only way I was able to get uh, see like, see any good levels in Doom. Just through safe stating. Every like every like new area, I would just start a new save. God, this level sucks. Thank <laughs> you. 
Here's the end, I think. Yep. Although I do find it comforting that the same winning strategy for for this is the same as Top Gun. You just go up to the side, <laughs> let everyone fly past you. Very minimal contact with any actual enemies. Several safe states. Yeah, I don't remember a whole lot about second mission, so I, I just remember it being very difficult. But I also, at that time too, though, I wasn't very good at Top Gun either, so I don't know if maybe I'm a little better. We didn't blow at that time and <laughs> explode on impact. Yeah, see, I don't even I don't even know I don't remember if I even got past the first level. It's been so long since I tried to play that game. I don't, honestly don't know. Uh, oh, okay. We're on the last mission, the last real mission, which means we're about to get killed. Your hitbox is pretty lenient as far as where the bullets can be on the screen. I'm actually kind of curious as to what the actual, like what your hurtbox looks like. It doesn't look like it's the wings. The, the bullets are going straight through the wings. So I'm actually wondering, is it like the like the, the front of the plane? Like that, there's like that little triangle I guess in the front? Like if that's what can't get hit? I don't know. funnels you in here. I don't know how I'm supposed to avoid it. Sometimes I can avoid it, sometimes I can't. So I don't know what to do. Oh, 
This fight's actually a little easier because the boss can only shoot one bullet at one bullet at a time at you. So you can bait one to shoot and then you have full you have like a free shot at the ones against the side. We for sure have one continue left. So let's let's test out our new barrel roll technique. <laughs> Cause my plan is whenever that thing shoots just to go like that. And then just go across the screen. Hopefully nothing bad happens. <laughs> yeah, hopefully, hopefully the cat doesn't uh doesn't start clawing at the door. And then uh, right now my grandma's friend from Japan is visiting, so she's staying in the next room. So a little more chatter than normal, I guess, because my, my grandma's got a friend over. Like uh, her friend comes over every like couple years come to America hey thanks for the raid John what's up man all right here we go Oop, the barrel roll didn't work that didn't work what are you supposed to do Hit him! What are you doing? No! Oh, good, good. Oh, we gotta beat this cold guy all over again. What? Get out of the way! I take it back, this game is terrible. What is with these controls? Look like he's flying all over the goddamn plate. Why? Can you not shoot me down here? I think we got him. We got it! <coughs> yes. So are we... are we done? Hey! Mission complete! 
Alien invasion fleet destroyed. Game over. We got it. Wasn't able to get a picture, but we, we got it.